Hello everyone, today we will talk about the greenhouse white flies, damage caused by them to different greenhouse uh, crops and their uh, biological control with parasitoids like uh, Encarcia formosa uh, and Eretomoceras eremicus. Greenhouse white flies are the tiny uh, white colored flies that live underside of the leaves where they lay eggs. Eggs hatch into uh, small limbs. Among these species of greenhouse white flies, Tri Allurodus vaporaro rerum is the most damaging pest of greenhouse crops. Flies are known to cause both direct and indirect type of damages to crops. Both adults and nymphs of greenhouse white flies cause direct feeding damage by sucking cell sap from underside of the leaves. Due to heavy feeding, infested leaves turn yellow and curly and dry quickly, and ultimately, plants uh, will die. White flies also cause uh, indirect damage by secreting sugary honeydew on the leaf surface where it promotes growth of black sooty mold that will affect photosynthesis as well as reduces the aesthetic value of ornamental plants. Uh, white flies also transmit plant viruses that can affect the uh, crop yields. Here you can see the progression in disease caused by white flies to roses of Sharon seedlings from their initial infestation until the uh, seedlings are completely dead. This indicates that if greenhouse white flies are not controlled on time, they can cause severe loss to greenhouse industry. Currently, chemical insecticides are not recommended for the uh, control of uh, greenhouse white flies because of their detrimental effects on the human health and the environment. Therefore, different biological control agents uh, such as parasitoids are recommended for the controlling uh, white flies in the greenhouses. Parasitoids are tiny wasps that can parasitize white fly nymphs and kill them. Currently, commercially available parasitoids including Encarcia formosa and Eret moserus eremicus are used as effective biocontrol agents for controlling greenhouse white flies. Although both parasitic wasps can parasitize white flies, Encarcia wasps feed only internally on nymphs, whereas Eret moserus a uh, wasp feed both externally and internally on white fly nymphs. They are also more heat tolerant than Encarcia wasps. For the effective control of greenhouse white flies, release PP of these parasitic wasps uh, at the optimum rates for the preventative or curative control as given on this slide. Um, avoid hot spots while hanging uh, PP cards on the branches of white fly infested plants. So how do parasitic wasps control greenhouse white flies? Adults of wasps will emerge from the released PP in the greenhouse and parasitize white fly by laying eggs in underneath or inside the nymphs of uh, white flies. Then hatched larvae will feed on the um, white fly nymphs and kill them. That is how they will control the greenhouse white flies. Visit bugsforgrowers.com to learn biological control of insect pests uh, of different greenhouse and field crops. Thank you for watching. Please comment, like, share and subscribe.